What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Omega Ruby walkthrough. Okay, so, in this episode right here, we're going to do something pretty awesome right here. We're going to be continuing our capture of the legendary Pokemon that are around here in uh, Hoenn, especially in this game. Now, I believe it's around, uh, I believe it's this. I think I have the three Pokemon, but you do have to have three Pokemon with maximum effort values in order to find these guys. I believe we're going to be going for the, uh, what was it, the the Guardian Pokemon, I believe that's what they were called, uh, from Unova. So now, we just need to get, we, we just need to make sure that we, we know where they're at. If the island actually appears for us, then that means we actually have Pokemon with ma uh, maximum effort values right here. Now, as you can see, the nameless path is right here, right across the street, but right now it is currently, what, 5 o'clock? So I'm going to have to wait in the Another two hours, two, three hours in order to get to the next uh, legendary Pokemon right here. And, well, I guess we are actually... Yeah, we're right. So, here we are in the Pathless Plain. Like I said, guys, you have to have three Pokemon, okay? Maximum value efforts. Basically meaning they have to love you a lot in order to appear in this whole, this whole uh, area right here. Now, the three Pokemon that I actually do have is, let's see... You feel a strong gaze and like something is calling to you or for you. Now, the three Pokemon that I have it happens to be Hydra, Sage, and Gaia. So, those are my three Pokemon that really, 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 really love me. And, uh, well, let's see. I had to replace uh, Sir Razor out of here because, well, let, let, let's, just be, let's just be honest. It, it wasn't really doing me any good right now. So, what I'm going to be doing right now is I'm going to be switching it up to Fluff Blade because, well... Let's see. It does. It, it it does have a dragon breath and all that crud. So, let's see. Let's see. Well, let's see. All right. So we're gonna be going right here. I just got a message and all that stuff. Ignore that. So let's see. What Pokemon will appear first? I do not know. We're just gonna have to find out. Now, again, these Pokemon will only appear if three of your Pokemon actually love you. So we're gonna put on a save and. Well, let's, let's see what Pokemon we're actually going to be finding right here. So, put your hand deep in the hole, Giggity, right there. And the Pokemon that appears before us is Terrakion. Now, this Pokemon right here is a tough one. It is a very, very tough one. Every single one of these Pokemon are fighting-type Pokemon, and crap baskets on a crapsicle stick. I do not have... Yeah, I do not have uh, Dragon Breath on it, so I'm going to have to risk it and go with uh, with our good old buddy, what's his name, uh, a tank right here, even though it is a normal type Pokemon. And here comes its Sacred Sword attack, and that finishes off my tank, so yeah, I'm really, really not, uh, yeah, I'm really not feeling it right now. So let's go with Hydra 2. I do believe that I did teach it Underwave, so maybe that probably would have been the best idea right there, you know. All right, so its attack has fallen, and uh, yes, we do have a Thunder Wave. Luckily for us, these guys are not Rock-type Pokemon right here, so look at that. Terrakion is now paralyzed, and it can't move. Again, these legendary Pokemon are going to be a little tough to actually capture. Uh, I do not want to risk trying to hit it with anything that I have, so what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to switch it up. Let's go with Fluff Blade, and hopefully, just hopefully, let's just, like, you know... We, we, we don't screw up right here because again these Pokemon only appear one time and here comes the rock slide and crap oh damn okay so that probably would have been used against my uh, my good old buddy right here so let's go with the dragon pulse here it is dragon pulse please do not kill this Pokemon and it didn't and what the hell that was a retaliate right there yeah, these guys are these guys are really 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 trying to kill me right here so here we go in again with another dragon blade hopefully the, or dragon pulse hopefully it's not a oh crud yeah like i said it's not a, a critical hit or anything like that now we're gonna try and hit it with something that won't affect it very very much so damn let's go with a uh, dragon pulse i probably should have taught one of my pokemon like dragon range that way it can be like 40 hp and oh my god nearly makes this pokemon go to sleep and there goes Fluff Blade. So, it already did its job. 
Let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon right here. Let's go with Sage of the Halo. It will not be as affected as much, hopefully. So, let's go with a Pokeball right here. Let's see what can we what we can find right here. Let's go ahead and use Ultra Ball since, you know, we're outside. And we're not in any cave or anything like that. So, here we go. Ultra Ball, come on, baby. Ah, right. crud. So, Terrakian is trying to... Yeah, it's trying to mess with me right now, and so far it's using its most powerful move right here. Let's go right ahead and use timer balls. Yeah, they get stronger along the along the way. Not every single timer ball is gonna work. And here we go. Nothing right there. So this Hurricane is just gonna keep on hitting us until I don't know. I, I don't know. It probably wants to come with us. It doesn't see us as worthy. Now remember, in our Pokemon Black walkthrough, we actually finally captured these three Pokemon. It was uh, actually, it was actually a, a miracle too because uh, I did not know that we could capture them before the Elite Four. Well, two of the three we didn't know that we could capture them before the Elite Four. So that to me was a uh, pretty amazing right there. I'm actually very very happy that you know there was a lot of firsts on Pokemon Black, and then we got to complete it. And come on, yes. So there it is, guys. We cut ourselves Terrakian, or Terrakian. Sorry if I'm butchering the names. I really, really don't care. <laughs> okay, alrighty. So we got this guy right here, and well, there it is, guys. Terrakian, Terrakion. It is both a rock and fighting type Pokemon. It's six foot three, five hundred seventy-three pounds of pure muscle. Its charge is strong enough to break through a giant castle wall in one blow. This Pokemon is spoken in, of, uh, of in Legends. Alrighty, that's cool. That's pretty awesome. So there we go, guys. Another, another legendary Pokemon down. Now, we're going to have to wait and see something right here, guys. Because today is Saturday, too, as I am recording this. From what it says right here, when soaring by the Pacific Log or Pacific Log Town, you will discover a large island called the Pathless uh, Plain. When you land, you will find a small path to, the, uh, to a peninsula where a portal is standing. Interact with the portal, and Verizon, Terrakian, and then Cabalion will challenge you. Cabalion can be uh, captured on Sundays, Sundays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. Terrakian can be captured on Tuesdays, Saturdays, and Verizon can be captured on Mondays and Thursdays so unfortunately for us it's it's Saturday so we're gonna have to wait until tomorrow in order to capture the next Pokemon right here so yes guys this is it right here thank you guys for watching in the next episode I believe we're gonna be going to one of these stationary Pokemon that are right here I am thinking we're gonna be going for hmm that Pokemon from Sinnoh, probably. I don't know. The Scorch Slab and something. So, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna park right here, and uh, yeah, we're gonna call it an episode right here. So, again, guys, Terrakian, you can capture it on Saturdays. Let's see, Sat Tuesdays and Saturdays. Verizon or Verizon, or I don't even know how to pronounce this guy's name. You can capture him on Mondays and Thursdays, and Cobalion Sundays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. So tomorrow, yeah, there will be. Well, tomorrow there will be an episode of Cabalion, so do not worry, guys. Again, uh, all these episodes are not really in order, so yeah, that, that, that that's kind of like a big downside to it. But it is what it is, guys. At least I'm getting them done. So thank you guys again for watching this episode. I will see you guys next time. Alrighty, I'm in it to win it, guys. I really am. It is uh, currently midnight, so technically it's Sunday. And I was kind of freaking out just a little bit why the island didn't appear, and I completely forgot that, oh, I need three Pokemon with uh, high effort values and all that stuff, you know, love, affection, amour, or something like that, I don't even know, uh, it goes the same way for the Nameless Cavern and everything too, so let's go right ahead and uh, see if we can actually get that extra Pokemon that we need to get, yeah, okay, so here we are, back into the island, the pathless plain, and we're back, baby. I'm ready. And you feel a piercing gaze sizing you up. Oh damn! So it looks like uh, it looks like uh, it, the the person or the Pokemon is here. So let's go right ahead and uh, take care of business right now. Okay. So it is Sunday technically, and the next Pokemon that uh, that's on the list is Cobalion or Cobalion or whatever you like to call it. I don't even know. I like to butcher names and stuff. So. Let's go right ahead and uh, 
Well, let's do this first. It's the same strategy, guys. Same old strategy. We paralyze it. We paralyze it with Hydra, and we smash it with uh, with Tank. So I think that's that's all we need to do. So let's go ahead and uh, put our hand in that hole and uh, see what kind of Pokemon we get. Alrighty, and here it is. Cabalion has come out ready to fight and again these Pokemon are at level 50 and yeah they're all fighting type Pokemon so uh just be aware of that one right there so let's go right ahead paralysis paralysis right here wow getting the hiccups and everything and look at that it is paralyzed and of course we're getting lagginess onto the internet just because I don't even know. But look at that. He's using his uh, move right here. And so, let's go right ahead and uh, continue on with the whole business right here of Tank. Tank the Snorlax. And hopefully, uh, this guy doesn't use his fight type with the attack because it's going to be very, 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 very strong. And here's a retaliate attack. Wow. Oh, wow. Okay, so let's go right ahead and go with the body slam. Hopefully this does the trick right here. Not so effective. Oh my god, okay, so... <laughs> I think I remember that this guy is a, both a steel and fighting type Pokemon, so... Yeah, we're gonna have a... Yeah, we're gonna have a parade with this guy right here. Look at this. Oh damn, oh damn, and here comes a sacred sword attack. And uh, that nearly destroys my uh, tank right here. So let's go again with another body slam attack and not so effective okay so we get another chance right here just to just to try and beat this guy right here so here we go body slam and that nearly does it so here comes another sword stance so this guy is giving us a chance he is giving us a chance to actually capture him i guess he sees that we're actually pretty, like a, we're actually a pretty good trainer right here and it's in the red okay so you cannot move Alrighty, so let's go straight for the Pokeballs, and as always, we're going for Timer Balls right here because, uh, well, gotta love the Timer Balls. Okay, so here we go, Timer Balls, let's go. Okay, oh damn. <sighs> you, 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 got, you, got, you gotta love all these Pokemon right here. The legendary Pokemon, how hard it is to just try and capture them. So, here we go. Timer Ball, let's go, and... Well, one. No! Nearly gets captured right there. So, yeah, this guy does know Iron Head. And that is that for Tank. So, it did serve its purpose right there. So, now we're going to be switching up our Pokemon right here. Let's go to Sage of the Halo. Mainly for the fact that, well, it's, a, it's, a, it's, it's way, uh, way over leveled. And I don't necessarily think that, you know, the balling can actually do some damage to it. You know, fighting type moves, steel type moves, and all that stuff won't do much. So here we go. Timer ball does not work. Holy crap. Okay, so here it is. He's paralyzed one more time. So let's go right ahead and use another timer ball. Come on. Stay in the ball. Be in the ball. Be the ball. And this guy is not staying in there. Okay, so of course he's going to be using Iron Head right here. And that take a... Well, of course it took a whole chunk just because it has... Uh, it used up Sword Stance, so let's go ahead and do this again. One. And there it is! It has been captured. That was a close one right there. What now? Okay! Alrighty, so... Look at this. Ladies and gentlemen, me, Cabalion, the Unova Iron Will Pokemon. It is both Steel and Fighting type Pokemon. 611. 551 pounds of iron will, and of course, it has a body and heart of steel. It, its glare is sufficient to make an un, even an unruly Pokemon obey it. Really? Okay. And, well, this guy's not going to the box, so uh, well, let's, let's go ahead and take a look at this Pokemon right now. So, let's go ahead and take a look at this guy right here. So, as you can see, Kabalian. It is both a steel and fighting type Pokemon. It has the effect Justified, which boosts the attack stat when it's hit by a dark type move. You guys can't see this part on the bottom uh, part of the, sea, uh, the, the, the scene right here, but it does have Retaliate, Iron Head, Sacred Sword, and Swords Dance. And, well, it is naive, and of course, we captured it on November the 15th. Yeah, buddy. It is all good right here. Now, 
I will be capturing for Ryzen. The only thing is that I have to wait until, well, midnight again, because you can't, you can only capture it on Monday and I would like to say Thursday. So since we're doing it on back to back to back days, I might as well do that. So I'll be right back for another, uh, another capturing right here against uh, Verizon. So I'll be right back, guys. Alrighty, guys. So here we are in the final part of this whole, you know, uh, Guardian Pokemon, uh, well, not capturing and all that stuff. As you can see, you feel a quiet gaze testing you. I think we all know who that is right there, right? That's right. The Pokemon name after a phone company and all that stuff. So, uh, like I said, I'm going to keep on saying it, guys. Uh, these Pokemon are it can be captured throughout the days. And, well, I had to stay up until midnight, to mo Monday midnight, and to actually get this whole thing right here. So, it is finally time, guys. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you, Arceus, for helping me out right here. So, let's go right ahead and just go straight for it right here. Put our hand in the hole. Yes, giggity! Here it is, guys. The last of the Guardian Pokemon right here. And that is a Verizon. And, uh, well, like I said in the text, you can actually find this Pokemon on Mondays and I believe Thursdays. I'm not going to wait till Thursday. So, might as well do it right now. So, as you can see, Verizon, level 50... And I, you know, by the look of its color, it is a grass type Pokemon. So let's go ahead and paralyze this Pokemon right here. Look at that. If it's not broken, don't fix it. Okay, and here comes a sacred sword attack. Holy bejeebus. Not very effective. Okay, so let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon right here. And, uh, well, let's go straight for Hydra. Oh, damn. <laughs> wow. Okay, screw it. Let's go with Hydra number four right here. Now, I did switch out my Pokemon because, like I said early on in this, probably in this episode and a few episodes, not all these episodes are going to be in order and all that stuff. Uh, prior to this one, I was actually capturing the Reggie. Prior to the other videos, I was capturing other Pokemon too. So, <laughs> it's a lot of stuff that I, w I was doing here, guys. So, let's go right ahead and go for a Dragon Rage. And that is 40 automatic points right there. And this Pokemon is going for a sword stance. So, yeah, this guy is no joke. So let's go ahead and do this one more time. Dragon Rage. Just to lower the stats just a little bit more. And so far, luck is on our side. So, again, another Dragon Rage. Hopefully, this will... Oh, God, yeah. So that the Dragon Rage actually worked out right here. And, well, it's not very effective right there. Now, I can't... I can't go for another Dragon Rage because I know for a fact it will make this Pokemon faint. So, let's go ahead and start capturing this guy. Now, we only got 13 uh, Timer Balls. I don't feel like we're going to be able to capture him with just 13 uh, uh, Timer Balls right here. So, hopefully... Uh, well, we are equipped with Ultra Ball, so don't worry about that, guys. We are okay. So, let's go. Let's get this. Verizon, you have been uh, on my mind... Now I gotta capture you. Again, guys, I waited until midnight on both this Pokemon and I believe Kabalion to actually to actually get him and all that stuff. So that's uh, that's actually very very good. So remember, guys, have three Pokemon that love you a lot and come in on Saturday, Sunday, and Monday just to capture them. Very very good. Okay, so let's go ahead and use another Pokemon right here, and I'm going to be using the Pokemon that it will have the least effect on, and that is. Talks a bit, man. Look at that. Making his, uh, well, making his appear a rare appearance again. So let's go with another timer ball. Let's see where we at. Come on. Come on. Crap. Yeah, this Pokemon is not going down uh, easily. And, uh, well, there's a Giga Drain. Not so effective and a uh, crud. So, I could, you know what? I could revive a Pokemon right here now. Let's see. Let's see. Do we have a revive? Yeah, okay. You know what? I got, I got myself a max revive a while back. So let's go ahead and revive Hydra 4 just in case Verizon likes to use uh, another move called Giga Drain right here. And well, let's see. Yeah, I'm not. Well. Alright, let's see what happens right here. Okay, so we got a bite attack. And Verizon is a fighting type Pokemon. So. Yeah, not so effective. And that right there, uh, yeah, oh crud. Yeah, it raises its attack. 
just because it's a dark type move. So let's go ahead and use another bite attack. Just chop a little bit of a its HP right here. And so here we are in the red, and of course we're just gonna keep on increasing its attack using uh, using a dark type move. So Toxic Batman, I think you've already served your purpose right here. So let's go ahead and start throwing some more timer balls. We only got ten of these things, so hopefully it works out. Come on. Come on, Verizian. Come on, oh, you suck. Okay, so here comes another Sacred Sword. Not so strong. Oh, it's strong, but it's not that strong. So here we go again. Another Toxie Batman Timer Ball. Come on. Stay in the Pokeball. Oh, you suck. Okay. Where there's a will, guys, there is a way. Yes. Do not worry. We're going to capture this guy. There's a reason why we're doing this three days in a row and all that stuff, so come on. Stay in the ball, man. Stay in the friggin' ball. God dang it! Ah, uh, you majestic-looking Pokemon. Why must you make it so hard on me? Why? Okay, here we go. Again, another timer ball. Come on, work for me. Do me a favor, man. One. Ah, oh, you suck. Now, it's funny, because this is like the actual, this is like the second time I'm actually doing this with these Pokemon right here. Uh, first time was in Pokemon uh, Black, and never really got them, uh, well, never really completed Pokemon Black and all that stuff, so that is actually pretty cool that I get to do that right here, and uh, well, we're just going to put him on the red, keep on increasing his attack, and this guy, again, going with another Giga Drain. I'm trying not to let him uh, go to yellow again, but he's really forcing my hand right here, so let's go ahead and just throw some uh, more timer balls right here. Come on! Stay in the Pokeball, man! Toxic Batman, you're our only hope right here. Come on! Stay in the ball! Damn you, freaking Verizon! You see, this is the reason why I got T-Mobile. Oh, God. Okay, so he's back in the yellow. He is, uh, yeah, he's not making it easy at all, so... Let's go again with another bite attack. Here we go. And you're back on the red, and uh, yeah, sorry about that. And here's another justified for this Pokemon's attack right here. And yes, he could not move, so let's go ahead and try these uh, timer balls again. Come on, man. Stay in the ball. Stay in the friggin' ball. Come on, one. Ah, you suck. Okay, so I'm going to be complaining about this all day long. So let's go. Come on. Let's go for another time ball. We only have four left. So if that doesn't work, then we're going straight for the Ultra Balls. And this is going to be like the first Pokemon that we haven't caught with a Timer Ball. And yes, its attack won't go any higher. So let's go ahead. Come on, Timer Ball. Help me out. Help a brother out. One. Damn you, freaking Timer Ball. Okay, and yes, he's going to try and increase his attack every single time, and, well, it won't be, uh, it won't be long now. Here we go, that's one. Damn you, Verizian. And, well, he's just going to keep on struggling right here. Now, hopefully he doesn't use the, the, the time, or the, the move struggle, because that's just, oh yeah, that's going to be bad. Come on, one, two, come on, come on, come on, and, yes, yes. <laughs> so the streak is alive, guys. Yeah, buddy, and Toxie Batman earns his level 50. What a freaking match right there, and look at that, Hydra 4, level 41, wants to learn Crunch. Eh, well, you know what, let's just go ahead and, uh, I'm not really going to be using this Pokemon, let's go ahead and take away Incinerate, don't worry, but don't worry, guys. I won't be using this Pokemon very much, but look at that. We learned Crunch. Everybody's getting more experience points, and there it is, guys. The last of the Guardian Pokemon, I would like to say. Or what, 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 what would you call these guys? So here it is, Verizian, the Grassland Pokemon. It is grass and fighting type Pokemon. Six feet, 440 pounds of pure grass. Its head sprouts horns as sharp as blades. Using whirlwind like moves, it compounds and swiftly cuts opponents. That is freaking cool. Okay, so we're gonna go straight to the Pokemon Center and I'm going to show you guys uh, the three Guardian Pokemon right here and then after that, just uh, we'll, we'll call it a day right there. So I'll be right back. Alrighty guys, so here are the three Guardian Pokemon, Terrakian, 
Volian, and Verizian. Now, each one of these Pokemon, I had to wait a single day just to capture them, and uh, it was successful. All three of them are fighting type Pokemon, but I, I have a distinct typing, uh, other typing to them. As you can see, Terrakian is a rock and fighting type Pokemon. Uh, Kabalion is steel and fighting type. And in our last one right here, Verizian, grass and fighting. Now, like I was saying before, yeah, this is uh, actually the second time I've ever captured these Pokemon onto a regular walkthrough. The first time was in Pokemon Black, the whole Redemption Tour and all that stuff. And these Pokemon proved to be uh, a tough one right there. So, there it is, guys. We captured all three of these Pokemon. And, uh, well, the capturing is going to continue. Trust me, guys. It's going to get very, very interesting. Oh, man. We're going to keep this uh, whole timer ball thing alive and all that stuff. So, again, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for being patient with this whole episode. I will be back for another episode of uh, Legendary Capturings right here on my Pokemon Orange walkthrough. See you guys.